This video is presented by EA Game Changers. Hey guys, Luke the Pomp up here, and today I've got a little island living tutorial for you guys. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can snorkel and dive in the oceans in the Sims 4 Island Living Expansion Pack. So before I get started, I'd just like to give EA a massive thank you. They provided me with a code for the expansion pack so I could go ahead and make some early videos for you guys. I've also done lots and lots more Island Living videos, so if you want to go and check those out, a link will be down in the description to a playlist so you can go and see them all. So, snorkeling and diving is a brand new addition to Island Living, which your sims can now do in the ocean and on the island of Sulani. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can snorkel and dive, and it is pretty straightforward, uh, but it could easily be missed if you didn't realise. So um, I've actually got a normal sim and a mermaid sim because there are a few things I actually noticed while playing. So if you've got a mermaid sim uh, or even a normal sim, what you want to do is you want to look out for these little boys here. So essentially you want to go and grab a sim, uh, click on the boy. So once you click on one of these boys, all the interactions will come up. So you can do free diving, you can do snorkeling and you can buy uh, gear. So you can buy um, a knife, treasure tool, underwater camera, rebreather and then a spearfish gun but that requires level 4 fitness so once you have brought all the equipment then you have even more interactions um so you can actually take underwater photos you can scuba dive for and then either seashells or treasure and you can scuba dive in general so i'm gonna go and get my sim to come on over and scuba dive they're probably gonna take a while to come on over here we go gradually swimming so here we go my sim's just gone and put their scuba diving outfit on and they'll go into the water and scuba dive so there we go my sim has just come back up from the water um, and changed out their gear so also you can scuba dive for like i said seashells or treasure so i'm going to go ahead and do some treasure diving so our sims will go back down and have a look for some treasure there we go so my sim has found the fingers of sulani so that's gone into my inventory um which is an item here so i think these are kind of like a new um household collection uh, let me have a look yes you've got the buried treasure section where this has got all the items you can find and then also we can take underwater photos so i'm gonna go ahead and try that one the sim will just go under and then we go we've acquired the photography skill and then we've got some underwater photos here which we can go and have a look at and put up so if you find a boy which is a bit more closer to the um, water you can click on it and then go snorkel so that means you can go and snorkel for fish and have a look so my sim is just gonna gonna come and swim over um as you can see they've got all the fish swimming around it and our sim will now if i go snorkel they will come on over and get in their snorkel gear and have a look at all of the fish and lastly, a nice little funny thing I did find, if you've got a mermaid sim and you go to snorkel, it actually doesn't let you. It said mermaids would never be caught snorkeling, a very taboo subject. So you can't actually snorkel with a mermaid, but you can deep sea dive. Thank you so much for watching, and I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and found it helpful. If you've got any questions or any queries, let me know down in the comments and I'll do my best to answer them. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, if you want to go and check out any more Island Living videos, a link will be down in the description to a playlist. So please a like, comment and subscribe. If you do subscribe, click the little bell icon because then you'll be notified when I do next make a video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!